Hello everybody, welcome to the official live cast of the round of 32, game number one between Strider84 and Dragoo. Strider with Wood Elves, Dragoo with Lizards, Strider won his group, Dragoo was runner-up. I can tell you that Dragoo is Belgian, qualified from CPC, Road to the World Championship. Strider is from Switzerland and qualified from the Season 3 official playoffs. Dragoo's won the toss, chosen to receive, so let's get into it. I might have said live, but it's a replay. <laughs> oh my god, instant blitz. Disgusterous. So I actually really like the sidestep. I don't know how typical this is for tabletop, the sidestep, but I really like the sidestep. I would have probably liked Strider's build the most if K-Fogs wasn't so nice to uh, get millions and millions of dodge. No, nope. well he made a rush on a blitz. Always very dangerous. Can't use rerolls. And there might be. Yeah, the thing on t tabletop has Amazons, right? That's the thing. It, it's actually really good in this. But yeah, I could, I could under. I, I think it's a good idea for this. But yeah, I can understand just needing. Needing tackle in tabletop. Oh my god, have I been muted through the whole thing? No, I just coughed. I hadn't unmuted. I, I did all the I, I did all the I did all the intro and stuff, didn't I? This is done good. Okay, it's not too bad. I was coughing, I coughed my guts out and then so and then forgot to unmute. Right, thank you. Right, okay. Not a disaster then. Sons are quite good. And uh, thanks, Maud, ready? Thanks for saying it, otherwise I would have been kept muted. Um, so it's all right. I, I, I have been talking, so it's all right. <laughs> okay, so it's not too bad then, but yeah. It's, it's better than hearing me cough my guts out anyway. Okay, so he avoided the uh, dancer annihilating him. It's a cons I mean this is it's a constant battle though, isn't it now? Like his team split and This is oh god, he's gotta re roll. Double ones. <laughs> I mean it's probably the right move. You know, probably the right move. Just uh You know, you've got to you've got to go one way or the other, and you've got to clear everything. You've got to roll a bunch of dice this turn. You're in a terrible situation, and uh, now it got a little bit more terrible. <laughs> now he's got the ball and a bludger, and you've probably lost. <laughs> Yeah, they, they they recovered for that turn, but then the next turn was the problem, wasn't it, right? Like Strider set up to it to take advantage of the next turn. I get the blitz had already killed them. Really. <laughs> it's the boat down. This was like my game versus Truk, right? Like the kick, the kick and the officious ref just killed him. So like, I was in no hurry 
to finish the job. <laughs> That's why I was like so patient that game because I thought, well, it's over, right? I just literally thought it was over instantly. And uh, I guess that's what Strider was thinking here, right? It's over. I just need to stick people around and things will happen next turn. And they did. Or like the turn after or whatever. Honestly, against, against Woodies, you need to not get blitzed on. And you need to not fail a dodge and get cast. And um <laughs> You just gotta like Vengabus to death, right? You've gotta like Vengabus all the time. Don't let them get the, the cheap sack and uh and then just hope that eventually your lizards kill them. So 12 player on dwarves. Um, I would get another runner, but I wouldn't build another sack, or I would just a dirty player. Just a dirty player. Well, Apple's the second badly hurt because you can't have all of his kinks die. And the Wood Elves are 1 0 up almost instantly, and Drago is feeling pretty bad. Time out, that makes it gives them the stall as well. Outrageous. Cause he only movement seven, he can't get in a proper script. He should have moved it already though, right? He's only got one re-roll. Even if he's planning on re-rolling these blocks. Get the ball up and in a cage, mate. Come on. Come on. I mean, you might as well fight the tree, right? You've got so much strength. Oh, I'm not a fan of this. Uh... No, it's alright, isn't it? I guess because it's layered. I guess because it's layered, it's alright. I mean, it's not a strategy guide, Disgruntled Orcs, it's how you beat Wood Elves. <laughs> if you're lizards and you get blitzed on, you don't beat them. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> it's quite simple. If, you, if you're playing against Strider and he's got Wood Elves and you've got lizards and he blitzes, you just lose. Simple. I mean, you can, you can set up to stop the blitz, which he didn't, to be fair. So there is, there is a strategy guide, there is the perfect lizard setup, which you can set up against... Um, so, you, you know, I, that is generally how I set up because Azalus is the only way to lose is getting blitzed on. Um, Drago won the toss, chose to receive. Please, Truk, use proper Games Workshop English. It is, the plural is Saurus. Um, also, Truk, is it Truk or Trauk? Oh, one dice hasn't really occupied three three Sauras. They don't give a shit. Look at that. I think this one would have come in there, but never mind. Yeah, definitely this one in here. I think. I mean, so oh yeah, I would, I, I wouldn't. So PTK same league as Purple Goo, and maybe Diamond, and then everybody else, like you know, a tiny bit behind that. Not miles behind, but at least a little bit behind. Like a tiny amount behind. I mean, enough to say they're both tier one, right? Like, so you could put them in the same tier, definitely. It's all just splitting hairs one way or the other.
Yeah, Blood Bowl 3 PTK, not quite up to the usual standard, is he? Oh man, look how bad the comedian skink is, but at least at least he's got the ball right against against lizards. Against lizards, against wood owls. Well, probably have to go for the uh strip. He hasn't really got much of a defense, has he? It's pretty easy. Yeah, the tail doesn't mean a lot. Oh, fails the leap, casses himself. Oh my goodness, well, what a bad decision from Strider to Kaz, to Kaz his own war dancer, you see, that's a, here's a tip anybody, if you if you want to uh, beat Wood Elves, when they uh, try to leap sack you, just have them fail and die, and then you've got a chance, easy. Double rush to score. Makes it. Wow. But there is a one turn chance from Strider. So. This. Is not a defense, I would say. I'd go so far as to say. This is not really a defense. Doesn't make him use the whole method. Oh, quick snap. Could have put a catcher there in case, right? Does the pass, gets the catch, gets the push. There is this one as well, right, for the last ditch effort. So he can pow now and go there. He's got this with Wrestle. Well, he hasn't even blitzed yet. Okay, well even better. He does the jump, leap, whatever you want to call it. And he scores. There you go, Strider, pretty good at the one turns. Just quietly. Um, that gets him some breathing room, but this is not easy at all for Strider, down a dancer. Yeah, the chameleons, the little one. Yeah, the, the defense was, it was hard to call it a one-turn defense, honestly. That was not a good defense. Oh my goodness, the lizards get a blitz. Oh yeah, that was what confused me. Yeah, the quick snap saved the blitz. Yeah, that was actually, I mean, you could have done like an uphill and stuff, right? You could have just uphilled to have done it. Nope, and just like Strider's Blitz, he makes a rush, fails it, and hurts himself. Oof. Oh my, I mean, you've got to reroll that, I guess. Yeah, you just have to. That guy about to get surfed. Tree rooted. Mm. 
makes it removal law. I mean, that's the great thing that about the normal build compared to PTK's build, isn't it? Like, just casually casting a Saurus. Doesn't matter that it's rooted now. Incredible. Incredible. Oh, big Chi Chi. Uh, it was all a bit weird today because Go Go Bay couldn't play because he had a power cut. So. How oh, was that tail? Yeah. And it does do it. It does do a thing sometimes, obviously. Yeah, I quite like this 3D here. Keep them compressed. Oh, even rushing. Well, I'm not sure about that, honestly, because. You just don't want him to fall over, right? So. It's so bad if he falls over. And there we go. The replay is over. And at this point. Somebody said this was a chameleon skink bug. Maybe it's the chameleon skink. Dodging away from a chameleon skink? I don't know. But somebody did say, oh, it's shadowing. It's because of the shadowing? So maybe this was a shadowing bug that made that made Dragoo disconnect. But replays are only if a bug causes both players to disconnect. If a bug causes one player to disconnect, then they just lose. So, unfortunately for Dragu, two one down. Think you know, Strider was under pressure. He maybe he could have drawn this game, but um, well, whatever it was, it was a disconnect. It didn't affect both players. Um, whether it was whether whatever whatever it was, that's not for that's not for me to say. Whatever it was. At this point, Dragu disconnected, couldn't reconnect in time. And if it had been a bug that affected both players, it would have been a replay. But whatever the reason was, um, there you go. That's how you know. That's this is how an easy way to beat lizards is just have them disconnect. Um, yep. So there you go. Unfortunate. I do, that's the thing. I don't even know if there is a bug. Like somebody said, bug, but I don't know what it was. Um, it might not have been, been a bug, it might not have been a bug. Like, is it, I don't know if it's a bug. Somebody said it was a bug. I don't know if it's a bug. It did happen after the shadowing happened. But it could have just been... At the end of the day, I guess, you, you know, Sinai can't tell if it was... No, he couldn't. He couldn't reconnect. No, no, he tried to reconnect and couldn't. So, just is what it is, right? At the end of the day, disconnections are final. That's it. Because it would be too easy to abuse, right? If, if You know what I mean? Like... It would be too easy to abuse if you could disconnect on purpose and get a replay. So I don't think anybody would disconnect on purpose. Um, you know, like you, you can't really have any other rule. You know, unfortunately. Um, remember my uh, Super League, my game versus Cruz, where he's his laptop overheated, right? And it sucked. It sucked to win that way. It sucked for him to lose that way. But at the end of the day. You have to have that rule of just disconnections are final, unfortunately. So, there you go. Um, so, that's it. Ah, oh, so do you know what, Nayagi? Yeah, I remember that bug. So, maybe he got that bug, tried to disconnect to reconnect to solve it, and then couldn't reconnect in time. Maybe that's what it was. But whatever, whatever it was, whatever it was... Dragu disconnected. Strider gets the victory. Goes 1-0 up in the series. And uh, yes, Nyaga, yeah, there you go. So it's going to be real hard for, for Dragu now because he has to beat Strider to get to the third game and then he has to beat him again to win the series. So incredibly difficult for Lizard Men. But, um, I mean, congrats to Strider, I, get, I guess. Commiserations to Dragu. Thanks for watching, everybody. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.